aren't you? Drop it. I'm not the warrior of anything. Heroes from near and far are here to see the most heroic of all, the Warrior of Light! Yes, just keep pouring in! Everyone is here to celebrate you! I told you, I'm not the Warrior of... What is the Warrior of Light? The hero of the prophecy, destined to fell chaos and bring hope to the land. Hmm, remind me, what did you do again? I brought the story of hope to an end, and I caused the Dark Flood to wash away any memory of my deeds. So, you changed the world, but in doing so, you did give the world hope. How would what I did give anyone hope? If you don't believe me, that's fine. But have you ever thought about asking someone? Maybe a guest? Try and find out how they feel about you. Trust me, you can't just assume no one likes you. Makes sense? Good! Now let's head back there and mingle! Welcome back to Mobius Final Fantasy! The part 2 of the third anniversary... Anniversary event. So let's see what else the event holds for us. Still bombs with lightsabers. Okay. Yeah, keep trolling. You know what what he said here about um, I ended the tale of hope and let everyone forget about my deeds with the dark flood. Um, reminds me of something Vox said to him once. It's so you to paint yourself as a villain in your own tale. Yeah, it really is. Tried your best, and you failed. Catch up. And without further ado, let us proceed to the party. The guests are practically falling over themselves to greet the guest of honor. They don't need to be so eager, just talk to me like a normal person. Who knows what they'll say? Bain less excitement. Give him. Give him the honor of speaking to the one and only Warrior of Light.
Let's use a warrior skin for the warrior of light. And let's see the other guests, whoever they might be. So, what does a witch have to say to someone like me? What would I have to say but to express my gratitude? If not for you, I would still be but a witch bent on revenge. How droll that would have been. But I wasn't fighting for you. Not specifically, anyway. I'm well aware of that. I too thought of our relationship as one of convenience at first. Convenient for whom, I wonder. That doesn't matter. What matters is that in the end, you did help me. In a way that no one else could. And for that, you deserve every bit of gratitude I have to give. As much as a witch can give. And so she beats her gratitude into us, huh? Let the show begin. Let's talk to yourself. Oh, I'm so proud of you. It was my desire to see him again that created this phantasm. <sighs> How do I make it stop? I'm not sure you have to make it stop. If the phantasm comes for us, I don't care what it looks like. I'll beat it. Either way, we're good. Don't force yourself to forget. Memories are precious. Thank you. <sighs> Whether intentionally or not, your words did have an effect on me. I learned to keep holding on to my cherished memories, no matter what. And I shall honor those memories by protecting the world he loved so much. <laughs> I sound so optimistic. All thanks to your deeds, they gave me hope. You found that hope all on your own. Wary of gratitude as always, I see. I just don't like to take credit for things I didn't do. Maya decided to be hopeful. No one else. It's got nothing to do with me. Hmm. Who else is here? Shifts, but your grimace remains unchanged. And you remain a charmer as always. I have been many things, but charming may not be one of them. Because even though I tried in earnest to urge you to become the warrior of light, you paid no heed to my words. In the end, you decided not to take on the burden of ending the story I helped create. But I did it anyway, didn't I? 
Indeed, the end you brought to the cycle of hope was unequivocal. However, that doesn't mean hope is no more. For as long as people yearn for their wishes to be realized, the world shall yearn for the tale of, of a struggle to make it so. My spirit burns with the flames of desire. Seeing you smile is all I need. The prophecy is finished. The Warrior of Light has brought a fitting end to Palamecia's story of despair. However, the story of despair is but an aspect of the story of hope, and the end of one spells the end of the other. And now the heretics who dared to bring that end are met with their reward. Slumber, from which they may never wake, if they wish. Will the new world they help shape go on without them, as the threads of fresh tales begin to weave together? Or will they content themselves to fill a new role in the story to come? Something entirely different from what they have come to know? The answers to those questions are not for me to say. These three, however, Sid? Well, you're not really Sid. I... I am but a phantom, as are the rest of the residents of this vision. But that is hardly a point worth considering. For no matter how fleeting we are, your deeds shall carry on for eternity. Thanks to your efforts, true hope now fills Palamecia. The moment I met you, I knew that you were destined to bring great change. You saved this world from the unending cycle of misery and despair. Its citizens are now free to finally live. You have left an indelible mark on Palamecia. Never again will we be stifled by the words of an ancient and inimical tale. Although it may seem a desolate backdrop at first, I have no doubt that in time, a new hope will spring from the ruins of the old. How cheery. <laughs> and when that new hope takes root and sprouts from the earth, we shall have you to thank. Warrior of Light, you have my eternal gratitude. Eternal gratitude, huh? Doubt the real Sid would say the same. Forever doubting. Typical, huh? Severin! Long live the princess! 
Long live Palamecia! They didn't even scratch it. How do they hope to defeat it? Do not falter! Cast aside your pride! Eternal glory awaits! Come, we hunt chaos this day! Hmm. What do you want? Not much of a talker, huh? Wait, have we met before? Yes, with the captain of a Cornelian guard. Cut him down. Whoa. Your final? May my life be error! You defended valiantly. You're not tired. No, this was interesting. Seeing him in again. Hadn't thought ever to do that. Well, he's dead. So I'm Caster. I hail from Finn Castle. Princess Sarah, witness me. We blanks have no memory of our past. Perhaps when we die here. We are reborn with our memories elsewhere. What are you saying? Even if our memories do return, a pointless death is a pointless death. Maybe so. Live long then, friend. And if you live in glory, rather than die for it, then our deaths are not pointless. Stop. What are you doing? I... I am Laro of Eblen. May my light be cast on Princess Sarah! No! You didn't have to die for me, but I will live for you. It's been a while. It's you. No need to pretend you haven't forgotten. I'm just one face among the countless blanks you passed on your journeys. No, I remember you. How could I forget? Lero, it's an honor to know I made an impression on the warrior of light himself. Allow me to thank you on behalf of the dead. By your deeds, you gave purpose to our sacrifice. Now the foundation for lasting peace has been laid. Our lives and our deaths were not in vain. Your victory is our victory. Walk with your head held high for those of us who can do so no longer. I will. They fought so that they could live. I fought because I didn't want to die. My reasons were as simple as that. I never wanted to be anyone's savior. Something someone pointed out to me. This turning around before walking away thing, how ridiculous that is. But Mobius is not the only game where that is 
because when you turn around and walk away you would normally make the first step in returning already but they never do that because it would be a rather complicated extra animation with very little game um, let's see what else comes no but that was cool seeing that captain again There's still so much I'd like to say to you. I bet. You used to be a princess. You didn't have to for care in the world. But now that's all gone. All because of me. And what's worse? You can't even remember why you should be mad at me. Do you think you made the wrong choice? I'm just saying if I... If you were mad at me, you wouldn't be wrong. If that's how you really feel, then... I really do need to tell you how I feel. What's she doing here? Did Vox summon her? I asked her to come. I'd have her watch the warrior of light face chaos. No. I'm not here to watch. I've come to fight. It was because of you that I gained the strength to find myself. If we hadn't met, I don't know where I'd be now. The fires of hope within me were set alight during our time together, and they still burn. But what comes after this? In this new world of infinite possibilities, I don't know where to place my hope, what to wish for. Hope for whatever you want. Hope for it all. There are no more laws saying you can't. You're right. When I find my hope, you'll be the first to know. Sarah has more hope than she knows what to do with. Good. I don't get it, though. Is there really so much to hope for in this place? What makes now so different?
Ah, master, what took you so long? I've been wearing for a fight, Kupo. If you want to fight, be my guest. But I thought you couldn't. Ha, <laughs> you got me. Mugus can't fight, usually. But at a party, all bets are off. I'm allowed to use every trick in the book, even the nasty ones. So, watch your back if you want to keep that head on your shoulders. Kapow! Really? You're fighting Moggy? No! He turns into... <laughs> Great. He turns into the Judge Magister from a Final Fantasy XII event. None can resist my splendor. Well, well, Master. That was some impressive fighting. Kapo. Okay, what's with the crazy getup? <laughs> Kapo. Well, after we parted ways last time, I went on an undercover mission of sorts. I found the Mandragora's HQ in an ancient airship. And it was there that I discovered... The Judge Magister armor. But as I examined the armor, I heard the approach of those malevolent Mandragoras. So I hid myself quick as could be inside the armor. Well, imagine my surprise when those vexing vegetables started casting a spell on the armor, with me in it. Nothing compared to my surprise when the armor walked. So, I was still inside when you showed up and, uh cut me free, you see. Hey, Master. Why the long face? Something got you down, Kapo? People just get on my nerves. Aw, what's the matter? You don't like getting showered with praise? <laughs> you better get used to it. You're this world's hero now, Kapo. So act like it. Puff up that chest, raise that chin, and put a smile on your face for those we've lost, Kapo. How would you know what the departed want? Can you talk to them? I'm a Moogle, not a fortune teller. But I don't have to be, because that's what I believe. And sometimes, that's the best we can do. Believe the best for others. Believe, huh? <laughs> Sorry. But it's not that simple for me. Exit. not. So how 
closet. Did their words put your spirits in high supply? Might have worked if they were real. I know they're just phantoms conjured up by the rune. There are even dead people walking around like there's nothing wrong. Sure, maybe they aren't exactly real, but their words still have meaning. The rune is just helping them express themselves. All for you! You're just making them say what you think I want to hear. We haven't done a thing! Their thoughts and words are theirs alone! They really are grateful to you! That's right! Didn't they tell you? Yeah, they did. There wasn't a single word of criticism. They acted like I was their savior. That's because you are! Your struggle wasn't for naught! Far from it! Malefic Visions who brought hope to the world. Oh, it sounds so lofty when you say it like that. But you did do something no one else ever has. For that, you should be proud. Proud about what exactly? Proud that your actions have given all these people hope. <laughs> I don't see anyone around here. All I see are ghosts. Poor imitations just trying to act human. Don't tell me they have hope. I'm not buying it. Grabbing people from my past doesn't make a party. You could have at least separated the living from the dead. This is a sick joke. But jokes are supposed to be fun, right? Well, cheer up a little bit. We put our hearts and souls into this. We knew you were a party pooper, but we didn't think you'd ditch one in your honor. Stop being a grouch! Ha 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 ha! A grouch he might be! But don't give the boy such a hard time! He's only like that because his eyes pierce the veil of deception and see straight to the heart of the truth! That'd make anyone grumpy! You think he can learn to smile just once? For us? <sighs> Why, that is entirely too much to ask for one who carries his burden. The burden of truth, of justice, he can't just cast it off. No, he must question every word, every gesture. He must even question his own faith, his own faith. It's little wonder that he took it upon himself to judge the laws of the world unfit and bring them crashing down. The warrior of light has lived up to his name and his duty. Well, that's quite a story you've made up, Gilgamesh. I don't remember being consulted about the facts of the matter. But I'm right, right? Believe what you want to believe. Tell whomever you want to tell. I'm going home. Ah, good old Gilgamesh. <laughs> He's awesome. your idea of fun. <laughs> but apparently her idea of fun.
Oh, let's face Lich. Ah, the classics. This is just my normal Lich, right? This isn't Arch Lich. Thanks, Echo. Here. We'll bring our dream to the whole world. Let's do that. Kraken is, in my opinion, the most boring of the four. You planned this big party, but forgot the entertainment. Huh, but the entertainment was arranged just to your taste. Fighting and loot, your two favorite things. <laughs> well, either way, nobody asked me. You might want to do that next time. No. But you would just refuse the party. You would give input on it. Anyway, on to Diamant. Big one. Time to face chaos. Finally broken. And now, come, Axel. 
We'll bring our dream to the whole world! Was it better or is there more chaos? Some ticket and a bunch of ability tickets. You truly are the warrior of light, but you are not the only one who has had that honor. Let's move on to the next item on the itinerary. Where warriors of light match wits and skill, fitting entertainment for a party such as this. Wouldn't you agree? More fakes. Is that the best you can do? Don't underestimate them simply because they aren't flesh and blood. They'll provide more entertainment than the fiends thus far. Now, test yourself against those who are your equal. He also found himself adrift in Palamisia if returned once more. Take this opportunity to live their journeys here. But I think we do that next time. Ah, so I have to warp to each section and then walk their paths. Okay. Anyway, we do that next time. And then, until then, I'm Mace and don't get lost. <laughs>